right, my loves, here we are in our new home. That's outside, so when you come in, you can go two ways. To the right is the kitchen, come around. This is the living room. So we're gonna do the living room first. Um, one thing definitely needs some more light in here. That's my husband walking around out back. Now, when I saw this home in the video, this room went forever. My husband was like, they used a widescreen camera. So it, they definitely did. So I wanted you to see this because you can't go on the website if you wanna see what the house looks like on there. So the fireplace is gas. Here's our closet. So that's one of the closets. And then we have this space right here. We got bookshelves and this is down here. So you can put stuff, we have that for both sides. Now we were lucky because we were able to get one that had a patio. So this is the patio. So on this patio, I think you can put out a leaf. You can put a couple chairs on this patio. So this is the backyard. So this is really funny because this right there across the street is your backyard. So as you can see, people have stuff out there. My husband is like, I'm just gonna put my stuff right here. I'm like, no, cause see right here, we have a fence. So the people that owned the house before us left the fence or the people before them left the fence there. There's Hunter. So this was great. Now Hunter's running. Okay, and that's the other part. Let's go back in. So when I saw the fireplace and the agent was like, oh, it's gas, you can turn it on. I was like, oh, that's great for Christmas. <laughs> Here's the next room. I mean, the rooms and open things up so you can see it. So this is really nice. Go around the room. But I'm gonna step out because I want you to see, look at the floor. So I don't know, I guess this would be the dining room. It's kind of small, but we'll make it work. Love the fixtures. So here's the kitchen. This, so this door opens up to the basement. The people that were here before us or before them left shelves, which are great. Now, I think I missed a room. I did miss a room. I have to go back. I realized I did miss one of the rooms. So these are the steps. Hunter is not having this. <laughs> he does not like these steps. Here's the half bath. There you go. So this is a nice size. Um, bathroom. We come this way. And then this way is the garage. We got a one car garage. And the trash cans. That's just the open space. We go back around. Takes you in a hallway. This is just a storage area and you know we're going to make use of that. Come back around. So this was going to be my craft room, but I realized there's a lot of stuff in there. So I think I'm gonna make this my little office in my craft room. And then what I'll do, cause this is a nice space. I'm gonna probably put stuff on the wall, it won't be an issue. And then I can put my other stuff, my overflow out here and my clothes, because when I show you our closet, I'm definitely gonna have to have an overflow and back up the steps and we're going to go all the way up to the top and for some reason I did miss a room this room so this room is listed as a nursery so this was going to be my craft room but I told my husband he can have it as an office so that is more than enough space for his office and his man cave. Okay, so let's go upstairs. So this is a three bedroom house. Oh, I already showed you the closet. And here are the steps. 
So we definitely probably have to put slip guards on here for Hunter to be able to go down the steps. All right, so here's a closet right here, your linen closet. So this is the first room on the left. So there's two closets, a little opening there. I guess we call that a little nook. Okay. And as you can see, all the floors are hardwood. I turned the light on. So this is the first closet. It goes all the way back there. And you do see it has a light switch. This is a nook. You could put a little nightstand or a table. There's an outlet right there. Here's the second closet. Doesn't have a light in there, but it does have hooks and shelves. And one thing, all the rooms besides the bathrooms have ceiling fan and the central air. So if you don't want to turn the central air on, you just turn the ceiling fan on. Here's the second bedroom, which is pretty much like the first one. It looks a little bigger. And then these closets, as you can see, you can hang this stuff up. It doesn't go far back. And then you have this nice little space in between the closets. You can put a desk there. And this is the, the whole room. This is the bathroom. This is very tiny. Cause it's like, boom, you're in there. And <laughs> that's it. Okay. And this is the biggest bedroom. Same type of closets, but they have this shelf. That area in between is a little smaller. And then you have this space right here. And then it has a bathroom inside. So there you are. The bathroom, yep. So this is the bathroom. Give you an idea. Now it's funny because one of these rooms is not this room. It's this room. You see that up there? So when I opened the linen closet, I found these little poles. I thought the pole was for these windows right here if you wanted to open it. But look up top. You take this pole and there is an attic up there. Oops. My husband was like, uh, who's going up there? <laughs> I'm like, we're going to get a ladder because I want to see what's up there. So that is the tour of our new home at Fort Knox. So I wanted to show you our yard from the other side, but they were out here cutting the grass and cleaning up. And as you can see, they did lay down some moss for the trees, which I'm loving because guess what? Now I could put my fairy gardens right here. And then inside the gate, I'm going to put my ducks. I have ceramic ducks and a little fence, so I'm gonna put them in here. So this is our yard. Um, whoever was here probably a couple times years ago put this fence up, as you can see that it's kind of rusted, but we are grateful to have it, and so is Hunter. So this is our backyard, a better look at it. And as you can see, people did put stuff out across the street. So that little cement right there belongs to us. So we will get our stuff out once we get settled and place it across the street. Well, my loves, that is the end of our video. Thank you for stopping by and spending time with me. Have a blessed day. And remember, it costs nothing to be kind. And we will see you in our next video. Bye for now.